direct proportions. This module will explain the basics of direct proportion. Students, in this module, we will learn about direct proportions. If an increase or decrease in one quantity leads to the increase or decrease in another quantity, then it is termed as direct proportion. Let us consider a scenario. Suppose preparation of 100 gram of rice requires 2 bowls water, then preparation of 200 grams of rice will require 4 bowls of water. Here we can see that with increase in quantity of rice, the water required for making it also increases. This is called direct proportion. In case of direct proportion, if one of the variables x increases, then the other variable y also increases at a constant rate. Similarly, if one of the variables x decreases, then the other variable y also decreases at a constant rate. Direct proportion for two variables can also be expressed by the relationship shown here. Now, we know what is a direct proportion. Let us see some examples. Example A. If y varies directly as x and x is equal to 12, when y is equal to 9, what is the equation that describes this direct variation? Explanation. We have the value of constant k as 9 upon 12, which is 3 upon 4. On substituting the value of k in the relation we get, hence, the equation for this direct variation is y is equal to 3 upon 4, x. Let's see another example. B. Could the relationship between the following quantities be represented by a direct variation equation? 1. The amount of time spent running at a steady pace and the number of miles ran. 2. The number of lawns you mow and the amount of money you make. 3. The amount of gas you buy in gallons and the amount of money you pay. Explanation All the three variations here are direct variations. 1. More the amount of time spent running at a steady pace, more is the number of miles ran. 2. More the number of lawns you mow, more is the amount of money you make. 3. More the amount of gas you bought, more is the amount of money you pay. Students, let's look at an another example. C. The cost of 5 kg of potatoes is rupees 210. Find the cost of 13 kg potatoes. Explanation Students, let's recall the direct proportion relation. Correct. Direct proportion for two variables can also be expressed by the relationship shown here. Here, the value of x1 is 5 kg, y1 is rupees 210 and x2 is 13 kg. On substituting the values, we get the value of y2 as 546. Hence, the cost of 13 kg potatoes is rupees 546. Let's look at an another example. D. A car moves at a uniform speed of 75 km per hour. How far will it travel in 40 minutes? Explanation. Students, here also we have direct proportion relations. Here, the value of x1 is 75, y1 is 1 hour or 60 minutes, y2 is 40 minutes. On substituting the values, we get the value of x2 as 50. Thus, in 40 minutes, the car will travel 50 kilometer.